So everyone is talking about the error because recently she was seen with the hickey on her neck and everyone wants to know who the special person is. Now in my previous video, I showed you who I think the person might be. The link is down below if you want to see that and I explain more of why I think it's that person. So definitely go check out that video after this video. But if you've been watching my video for the past couple of months, y'all already know dierra has been having fun regardless. Sis just needed to tell you she was single. She's been living single. And that's what I said in my previous video. Like sis been traveling, going to Miami and hanging out with her friends and stuff like that so i'm not shocked that there's a hickey on her neck we're gonna see even more than that throughout these months so y'all hold on tight just enjoy the ride and enjoy single diera okay i'm happy for her neek and soon carmen now speaking of carmen last week i reported that carmen and corey took to the internet to express their true feelings about each other which didn't go so well that video is popping up make sure you go check that video out but every time corey and carmen gets into these arguments corey always goes on these little getaways now this time is no different he went to atlanta and a lot of y'all was sending me receipts saying that Molly was also in Atlanta as well. Now, despite all the junk he was talking a couple of months ago, which he's been calling her crazy, a stalker, out of control, annoying for years, but that haven't stopped him from messing with Molly for five plus years on and off. So I wouldn't be surprised if he was out there with her. I'm not saying he was, I'm just saying I wouldn't be surprised because Corey will say one thing about her, but then he'll go back and mess with her again. But y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all thinking. Now, before y'all say that Carmen was in Atlanta with him, because he posted up this picture yesterday, Today. A lot of people thought Carmen was with him. No, Carmen revealed she's been in the house for three weeks. So this is an old picture of him and her. So y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all thinking. Now recently, Chris Sales did a prank on his son, CJ Cole, putting my hands on my new friend in front of my son to see his reaction. Now in the video, he pretended to put his hands on the girl and CJ jumped in and said, stop. Chris Sales told him it was a prank. And then he explained to him why he should never put his hands on a woman. So it was a prank, but it was leading up to a lesson. Now, a lot of people in the comments were saying that he should have did it a different way. This was wasn't it. He shouldn't have acted out and put him in that situation. But y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all thinking. Do y'all think that this was the best way for Chris Sales to explain this to his son? Or do you think that he should have did it in a different way? Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you're thinking. Until next time, peace.